Today we're going to go through how to add inventory items into MarketMan in bulk. We have an entire video that will go through both how to add items one by one directly in MarketMan and how to bulk upload through the Excel. Today we're going to exclusively focus on the Excel, how to fill it out, and how to upload it. So first we're going to go to inventory, inventory items. And then we're going to click on the top right actions button and import from Excel. From there, you have two options. You can copy and paste from an Excel file, or you can actually upload an entire Excel file, which is what we're going to go through today. So I'll click upload in Excel. And then I'll scroll down and download the sample file. Once you've downloaded the sample file, Open it up in Excel, and we're going to walk through first the mandatory columns that we need to fill out. So for this example, I'm going to use a case of vodka. So the inventory item name is Grey Goose Vodka. The supplier name is Susan's Shop. The price is $100. The unit of measurement is milliliters. The unit quantity is 750 because each bottle is 750 milliliters, and I get 12 bottles per case. So the number of items in pack is going to be 12. Now, those are the mandatory columns that we need to fill out when we're uploading this Excel. We can also add in the product code if your supplier uses a product code, a discount if you get a discount on the item, and we can price the item by the unit of measurement. In this case, I'm choosing to price the entire case, but I can price by the individual unit of measurement. This is really helpful for items like ground beef, for example, where oftentimes they're priced by the pound. If the item is priced by the pound, simply write yes. If not, write no. I can also add in my category and storage areas as well. If you're a more advanced user, you can also add in your minimum on hand and the par level amounts for this particular item. Now, I want to repeat that process for all of the items that I'm looking to add in Markman in bulk. The best way to do this is going to be to get an Excel order guide from your supplier and simply copy and paste the columns from the supplier's Excel into the Marketman template. Now, once I've completed this process, I'm going to go ahead and save the file to my computer. Then what I can do is return to MarketMan, scroll back up to the top, browse the file for my computer, open it, and press continue. Now, if you're on a Mac, what we would suggest, and if you're using numbers, is doing this work in numbers and then exporting the file to Excel so that you can import as needed. Once I've uploaded the file, I'll press continue, and Marketman will let me know if there's any changes that need to be made, any errors, or any corrections that we would suggest. Once I've completed this process, I've successfully imported all of my items into Marketman in bulk. Again, we have another video that exclusively covers how to add items one by one and in bulk. This will give you all the necessary steps you need to add your items in Marketman multiple items at a time. If you need anything, please don't hesitate to reach out at support at markman.com.